Morning guys, so I'm just walking to a meeting and uh, before I do that, I wanted to answer some replies from uh, YouTube, from the office that we opened in, uh, in Medellin, Colombia. A lot of people were asking, um, how did I do that? So for you guys that don't know me, my name is Vic Tipness. I'm CEO and founder of Blackstone Medical Services. We're the largest provider of home sleep testing in the United States of America. And I started this business in my kitchen about 10 years ago uh, with little to no money, uh, little to no credit. And people um, are curious. They're wondering like, how did you do that? How did you go from $78 in your bank account to having a company valued over well over $50 million? Um, well, I did that a few ways. One is I found a great product that I thought was needed in the marketplace. The other thing that I did was I surrounded myself with amazing, talented individuals. And when I found out that there was an opportunity for us to expand into Colombia, I, I started to really do a lot of research about the country, the, the market there, how things were, how were the people, everything. And, and I literally just analyzed it for, for a long period of time. I'd, I'd say maybe a, maybe a few weeks to a month. That's a, long, that's a long time in my book. And, you know, what I, what I discovered was that there are a lot of people in that country that are very talented and that are looking for great opportunities in life. And, and unfortunately, there's not a lot of opportunities like that uh, in Colombia and, and, you know, in other parts of the world. So I decided to figure out all of the, the legal requirements and all of the things that I needed to do to have an office in Medellin, Colombia. And I got to tell you, it was probably the best decision uh, of my life. Uh, the people there are amazing. The, the food is great. Um, you know, and, and everybody wants to work and everybody's committed to, to, to really benefiting, you know, um, the, our customers paying attention to the details. I mean, it, it's just, it's another level and I'm, I was so blown away, so impressed, but how I did it was by figuring out what were all of the legal ramifications there and then making sure that I had all of the I's dotted and all the T's crossed so that I was really able to capitalize on uh, us having an office in Medellin. And today we have uh, close to 100 employees there. Maybe we'll probably have 150 to 200 employees there by the end of the year. And, you know, we occupy about 10,000 square feet and growing. So uh, if you're in Medellin and you want to work for Blackstone, hit us up. Um, but for the entrepreneurs that are out there that are thinking small they're thinking that okay you started this business in your kitchen maybe you're in a city somewhere in the united states and you want to and you want to blow it up and if you want to blow it up you can blow it up you got to be smart you got to be methodical you got to work hard you got to stay committed and if you do that you can also have an office and be considered an international entrepreneur so hope that helps guys got to go to my meeting